interesting. It just sort of cuts over. First time ever actually doing that, so we'll see how that works. All right, now I'm going to go into here, and there we go. All right. So I got that set up, got that set up. Now I'm just going to click on start recording. Because I do like to record these things as well, just in case the live streams go a little bit weird. All right, so now let's go ahead and get back into it. All right, so last time, what we did, we... Oh, that's fire. All right, let's get away from the fire. So last time what we did is we ventured through the um, ice castle and learned that one of our party members, uh, Ferris, was actually the Fairy Queen, who is also the guardian of the last dragon, and now we are going to go meet the last dragon. So now we are just making our way there. And this is a nice little dark area. Super fun. Alright, let me pull up the other view just so I can make sure. Alright. Oh yeah, duh. I don't believe I need to go this way in particular. I do really love this ice spell. It just lets you cross all this stuff here. It makes it way easier. And that's the wrong path. Let's see here, what's this saying? It's taking a lot of damage for just <laughs> screwing around, what's this say? Silent stones. A stone has a will that only opens a road for those of the pure heart. Those of you stopped on this road, don't give up. Keep trying. Only open for those who are earnest. So essentially, if I remember right, it's one of those ones where you just gotta keep going and it eventually will open itself. You darn warrior, can I get a pl hidden, please? Oh, scorpions, of course. I hate scorpions. They poison me every single time. So, see, as I move around the screen, I eventually just sort of get locked into position and the stones move around over time. So presumably, if I wait long enough, looks like they are going to give me a path to somewhere. Where? I'm not 100% sure. Assume some way forward. That's a way out. I don't need that. What I need is a way forward. There's an opening there. Yeah, you guys can see that all right in there. Main reason I was doing that is just because I didn't want to pull out the light fairy. Might pull it out for the next time through. Ooh, statue. 
record your progress, that way you can return here. Okay. Yep, I'm pulling out the Light Fairy. Uh, angry, nope, you stay here. Whack, you go back. Because you're not really that helpful anyways. Light Fairy come out. And wow, that's bright. Uh, I'll put away the life fairy for now, I guess. And I'll take out the water fairy. Oh, you're maxed out. Never mind, I'm going to take out the... My buddy the anger fairy again. Because I don't feel like wasting those. Oh. No poison, please no poison. There again. Let's go up, down, back this way. Ooh, there's a cave there. With the path open now. Nice. Chest. You've gotta hit your chest, make sure they're not mimics. The land dragon key. See if I can figure out where to use this thing. That path is blocked now. Double kill. There's the path I came from. Oh, nice. Ooh, swing around. I'll go up first, see what's up here. That's the stairway down, that's where I came from. <sighs> well, during this downtime, I would ask, how was your guys' days? My day wasn't too bad, work was fairly chill. I work in an IT field, as <laughs> most nerds it feels like do sometimes, because we just sort of get put into those positions. But um, work was pretty calm, it was good, no, nothing was on fire, which is great. Alright, silent stones disappear as time passes, there's no road to come, there's no road to the jewel. Come back again. Lightning bow. Let's see. Hmm, a 10 damage bow. I prefer my maul, but... But yeah, so work was pretty good for me. Uh, right before this, I had my Pathfinder session. 
Uh, shout outs to uh, Valdi, Teal, uh, Peanut, and Solaris. Uh, if you're tuning in, very nice playing with you guys today. It was a lot of fun. Hopefully, you had uh, some fun with that, with my uh, <laughs> fun dungeon we were going through today. It was regarding a... Uh, what would you call it? A... Ooh. So we need this axe because it's the... has worst range in the entire game, but it's actually able to break these rocks. Well, maybe not. They ought to break some sort of rock that we need to break, so... Oof. Okay. Bad idea. But yeah, so, um... I played a game today. Uh, it was actually, um... They were going through a floor of this multi-level tower. Uh, where... Essentially, the mechanic is... Working with the... Different colors of light that are emitted by crystals in the environment so like there's one crystal that or one color of crystal that essentially makes a void like area uh, become solid ground so essentially they have to manipulate chandeliers of this light to be able to navigate across a void space in the meantime, you also have a crystal that essentially makes solid ground turn into... It was a purple crystal. That when it casts light, it makes the solid... Makes solid ground invisible. Specific solid grounds, I should say. But, yeah, so it just makes it so that you can't actually step on the ground, which is just interesting. Where do I need to use this axe at? And then last but not least, they just experienced a blue color of light that they are still trying to figure out. Currently, um, what they do know, in case they do tune into this, is that the blue light actually um, appears to make what a, looks like a solid ground untouchable maybe we'll let them figure it out it'll be fun that way okay I got an axe what do I do with it let's check the x-ray glass I don't think I ever actually use it on this place okay I got the rocks I did the far right area. I'm up there right now. Did the far left area. Did the southern area. I think. Can't remember. I'm gonna try. Yeah, I did, because that's where I got the lightning bow. So now, let's see do this here but yeah so it's a neat little I'll have to maybe talk about it a bit more once they actually get through the entire thing but it's actually this really interesting concept of just excuse me of the the lights causing different effects and actually they um We had to cut it a little bit early because life is tough sometimes. But, uh. The. Oh, that's an interesting. 
Jeez Louise, that hurt me a lot. I'm not even gonna bother about swapping the guys. But yeah, what it does is it lets it lets them actually maybe change the colors of the environment and colors that the crystals cast or maybe even mix the colors based off of essentially what equates to a fancy flashlight. So that'll be fun to try and incorporate with them in a manner that lets them... Oh, well, it's just creative. Let's them be creative about it. Get around the puzzles and sort of manipulate the light in ways that I wouldn't have thought of, but also made it as part of the game. So, yeah, it'll be fun. Uh, this is a game I DM, and then I alternate with one of my other or one of my players each, like. I do this Pathfinder game, and then one of my players, they, um, she has a D&D uh, &D 5e game that we play, uh, where my character is a Loxodon Druid named Mark with a K. And that's M-A-R-X-W-I-T-H-A-Q-U-A-Y. Why? Because it's funny. This axe was supposed to do something, wasn't it? Oh, door, come on, open up for me. Try again. Oh, come on. So close. Better. Yes. All right. Try this key. Stern Black Dragon is carved into it. Oh, come on. Are there any other doors? This goes up. Is there maybe another staircase around here? Hmm. I'll figure it out. And this is why I have the Healing Fairy. Save me when I make a dumb mistake like that. I don't want to say a mistake, but a misclick. This is a different path. <sighs> what are the chances that this poisons me? It did not! Wonderful! I don't think that helped any though. Unless... I need to go all the way north. 
there was like one little path to like the northeast, I guess I'd call it. That I did not travel through. Curse you rocks. Thank you. I uncurse you. That's the way I came from? No, I thought it was, but it's not. It's another path. Oh, shoot. Ouch. Nope, that just slips back around. And I just got poisoned. Hmm. Thankfully, I have antidote herb. Because the issue with poison is it also weakens your defense. And I just realized they use the phonetic spelling of mall versus the M-A-U-L spelling that it probably should have. That's funny. The ground is quite literally opening up underneath of me. I'm just going to keep running. Because I have no need for your money. Please, key work. Thank you. Oh. Stupid scorpions. All that for a sky dragon key. You know what? I got plenty of money. And looking over my inventory... I need to cut some items anyway, so I'm going to use this. Go all the way. You know, close enough. Drew two. At least I wanted to get through that other room to save me some time. This is definitely not faster. It'd be better, better have been faster to go to Drew one, but avoid you. I have to say, this music is honestly not that bad. I mean, they have a good mix of... It's all like... 
not quite rock in a way, it feels like, for a lot of the songs. It's like when you listen to a lot of the... Like, this one is a dungeon theme, but when you go to, like, the overworld themes or, like, some of the town themes, they're just, like, sort of chill... Hmm... chill track, I guess? Like, a. Uh, when you just, like, bop your head to it, sort of thing. Can't really do it too well with this one. No. No. Never again. Okay, more exploding floor. Um, let's go south here first. Alright, let's go north here first, because I'm trying to think about... Oh, actually, wait. Let's look at the map. I always forget I have this map. I can see the floor. Okay, so just north of me is where I came in. Go to the south, it looks like it's a set of puzzles that comes back, so there's probably a key at the end there. Same with the next walkway over. Um, so it looks like probably one of those two paths is going to be the way in the end. So I'm going to start with going through here. Jeez! Okay. What I love is for something to drop the poison herbs. Because those things are useful. And hopefully... These puzzles aren't as bad as... Oh, that hurt. And the lag. Oh, that was my fault. Get it here. There we go. Let's see if I can get this timing. Oh! Sometimes you can do those little short hops and stuff like that. Okay, great. Next one I might have it. <sighs> Impatient. <laughs> Some of these platforming puzzles are more just p tests of patience. Feels like. That's a ton of lag on those things, too. I think I was watching someone play like a Super Metroid randomizer. One of the Link to the Past Super Metroid combo randomizers, something like that, on... I forget where. But, um... <laughs> they were joking that it's like... 
Yeah, if there's like more than three entities on screen, the game just breaks. You feel that with this game. It just gets bad. That would have been a decent one, I think. That was my fault. I hit the button wrong. But yeah, like with the poison... A little poison sprite, plus you got the fireballs that this guy throws. Plus when I charge magic... The fact that that almost killed me. And that is why this guy is full level. timing. There we go. Two, three, four. One, two, three. It's gonna hurt. That's okay. Got across that darn path. All right. Part two. Electric Boogaloo. Lagfest. Now I could have jumped that, but I'm just going to wait for it to match up. It's right here, then I'm gonna jump. Oof, okay. The Dead Dragon Key. That's a fun name. Is there anything secret over here? This feels like there's a a secret item or something like that, just sort of chilling over in this corner. Nope, okay. platforming puzzles sometimes. Like, honestly, this game is pretty short. There's a total of... I believe five to seven bosses? No, five to... Well, there's only five dungeons. I think there's only four bosses, actually. Five bosses? Eh, I'll figure it out. 
about halfway through this dungeon, so we'll figure it out fairly soon. I'm right there at the end, just gotta... Oh, there's perfect timing on that, so next round it should be perfect. As long as the lag doesn't get me. Wonderful! Alright, I got a key! And I got cheese over there, then there's whatever is down here. Oh. A quicksand puzzle, or a moving platform puzzle. That's annoying. Alright, let's try that again. Oh, come on. That was my fault. Well, obviously, who's else's fault would it be? Alright. Jump. And jump. And jump. And jump. Insert butt clench here. And jump, and jump. And this is why I have the fairy I have, because this is essentially unlimited tries with no punishment. Good old diagonal movements. Alright. And then it's gonna... I'll get there eventually. Go here. Go down, keep going down, down, and we're gonna go this way, down, jump, it's gonna push me. This is just me playing bad. Okay, let's try this again. Jump! And then we're gonna jump this way, jump, jump, jump. Because you can't slide if you're jumping. <laughs> the chest was right there. Alright, let's try this. Mm. Oh, how I love moving floors. There, I just jumped too early. All right, we'll get this. Sea Dragon Key. Now I'm just going to jump. Go back. Drug that way. And go this way. And go this way. And this way. Go this way. Get pushed this way. That way. Then go up this way. And miss time my jump. Maybe it's easier if I just keep multiple jumping. Just constantly jump. Can't move if I'm... Alright. Hold up. Alright, move over here. Let it carry me, move over here. Last jump. 
moving platforms suck. That's okay, though. Alright, let's see here. Probably... Sky Dragon, or Dead Dragon first? Nope. Is it... Sea Dragon? Yes, it is. Alright. You got ice. So much lag. Dear Volcano, please stop trying to kill me. Okay, give me a second. I'm avoiding you like the plague. Same with you. Because you're just going to kill me outright. At least let me get to half health. You know what? I haven't seen any dark rooms for a while, and as soon as I turn this off, it's going to get a dark room, but I'm going to turn on the... Turn on the uh, defense jade. So one thing I'm curious about, so I, this game is not really a big speedrun game, because it's honestly just not all that well known, uh, and I've never speedran it or anything of that sort, but one thing I was thinking about doing was trying to learn at least, so there's a speedrun trick to essentially skip like the first two-fifths of the game, greater two-fifths of the game. And I uh, was curious if you all would want to see how that works. Um, this is a like a little side note after we get this stuff done. I can try and I can look up a couple guides. We can sort of true warrior carry on the will of the dragon and help the world. Okay. And just sort of learn how to do that and then just see if it's even something I can do. Thoughts on that? Let me know in the comments. Skill the dragon. All right. I gotta know. Wait, I can just do this. It doesn't tell me. Okay. Nope, nothing that way. Nope, nothing that way. Nope. Ah, shoot. I've been waiting hundreds of years for this time to come. Come closer. Cutscene. Darn it. At last we meet. My name is Fire Drake. I'm the last of the, of the dragons living in the world. It's hard to believe that you're the one the Fairy Queen picked. The ancient world was destroyed in seven days. The dragon warriors fought to seal the dark demon in your world. You are a descendant of that tribe. Can you dimly remember? The blood that flows through your veins will cause a sensation. If I had met you earlier, I could have put you on my back and flown you into the sky. I hope that you won't wait any longer. 
When my power is gone, the Demon King will appear again and destroy the Earth completely. Before that, please destroy him before he regains his powers. Only humans, protected by a spiritual power, can do it. I can no longer control the Demon King's dark power. Please accept the last remaining power. Woo, my strength increased by 5. My defense by 10, that's wonderful. There's no time, quickly before my strength gives out. We'll go quickly. So the extremely interesting thing that I find about that the how to phrase it that's like the culmination of the main character's journey right there you go through this entire process like you're the third or you're the third generation, I think is what it is at the beginning, of this line of heroes, or a line of adventurers trying to essentially save the... or not trying to save, trying to find the... Uh, find the last dragons to essentially become a dragon warrior and this is the first time you've been able to like this is the culmination of everything right there Rainer I'm glad you came back safe right right you saw the dragon but somehow, the Demon King's power has gotten stronger. Goblins have come into town. But isn't this our chance? The worm in the town was originally a monster living in the Dark World. Follow the monster, you can find the Dark World, where the Demon King is. Good. You can take care of the monsters in town. Rainer, go to the Demon King's place. We'll come to help you later. Only you can fight the Demon King on his own terms. Hurry up. Rainer! Come back safely. Don't tell me what to do. I'll do what I want. Before I do anything, I'm going to... I think it was room three. Yes, I'm gonna buy you out of all your jade. Actually, why? I'm gonna sell actually a couple back. Because it's just weighing me down, I'm not gonna use them. As much as I love these jades and stuff like that. The only ones that I've found actually use for, I have... I mean, you need the light jade because you never know when you're gonna get a dark room. You got a defense jade, you got an attack jade, you got a revival jade, and you got a health jade. That's really all you need. And any other thing is just going to weigh you down, so you might as well just do it this way. That way you have as light of a load as possible, because you just get so much stuff. Um, let's organize my inventory again. Let's copy. Move that there. 
Yeah, because I have three revival mirrors. I haven't even used any of them. I got a shield I never use. I'll just equip that. Um, yeah, I'll go see what I can sell or buy, but... Here's what I'm going to do, actually. No, not you. I'm going to put you back. Because that just lets me kill these things in one shot now. Yeah, I'm going to hold on to the fire sword because technically it's a magic weapon. I don't need you anymore because I have a bow. I'm going to copy that, move it to here. Don't need the spike boots anymore. Don't need the cape. Oh, I guess you could keep the cape technically, but that's risky. Let's see here, what you got? Yeah, none of that's worth it, so I'm just gonna sell. Sell this. Three thousand? Yeah, sure. Oh, uh, you don't buy jade. Okay, yeah. I don't think I have any other better armor here. Nope, nothing good. Well, nothing better, I should say. Can I steal from your chest yet? I wonder. Locked. Dang. Okay. Let's go to the general store. Which I believe is this one here. Two of those. Uh, two of these. One antidote herb. Well, two antidote herbs. I always get poisoned. I don't know why. Uh, by one of you. I think that's it. Let's organize my inventory. I'm gonna sell you. I'm gonna sell one of these. Because I have that fairy as well. I really need it. Can't buy that kind of thing. Honestly, no, I'll keep it because there's always a chance I need to break something. Actually, speaking of which, I'm going to equip that for the slight second. After I move this around. I want to break some stuff around here. Copy that. Move it to here. All right, let's copy. Put you here. 
copy, put you here. Copy, put you here. About the best my inventory is going to get. All right. Hey, Nancy Dorter. Speak of the devil. I'm curious. The only reason I'm doing this is because I'm curious if I can find a chunk of meat. I feel like there is one here somewhere. Well, I really don't need it. It's always nice to have a full heal item. Oh, meat, like I said. And an extra, um... Oh, what's it called? It's dark. I'm going to equip you. And I'm going to unequip you for now. And equip you. I'm going to be doing a lot more damage, but I got to watch out for monsters now because I don't have my auto heal. They drop antidote herbs. Who knew? I didn't. Nope, that's the way out. Our way back to town. All we gotta do is follow the wormholes. Eh, wormholes. And eventually we will find the way to Big Bad. Stupid scorpions. Dead end. kidding me. Still poisoned. Dang it. Oh well. Plenty of antidote herbs. Watch my health. Curious. Nope. Okay. At that moment when the cheese would have actually been useful.
I always remember entering from one of these holes over here. These herbs are going to be slowing me down soon. Ooh, this goes down though. It's good. Alright. Yeah, I'm going to start throwing some of these out. One more. I'll keep... Keep five. Because I just hate poison. The numbness wears off over time, but the poison does not. Nope, that's a dead end. That's all s interesting. It's like a texture trying to push you back right there. Interesting. Scorpions, go away. I have to say, the translation for this game is a bit weird. Everything's a goblin, not like monster, or like a... There's like one case where it's like monster. They're all goblins, like everything's a goblin. The scorpions are goblins, the bugs are goblins. All the Demon King's minions are goblins, even though one's a giant cockroach. Why are there so many bugs? Maybe something I'll look into when I do the retrospective sort of thing. Because what I, my what my goal is is to try and do a retrospective once I complete the game. Well, you got those guys. You got those guys. You got those guys. Some of these come alive. I bet. Yep, you right there. there whenever I need to. How the heck did you get here? 200 years new fairy queen is chosen. It's been a short time since this became fairy queen. I've made a lot of mistakes. Shocked to f to fond <laughs> to find that sorcerer Ramus had gotten out of hand. So inexperienced. You're new to this. What do you expect? It won't go perfect every time. In the Platinum Shrine, the Dark World will spread someday until it envelops everything. After everything is destroyed, only Doom will be moving. An eternity without time or space. I trust zero statues. That's the Void. <laughs> Cracked panels. Locked doors. Other locked doors. Okay. Guess I'm going this way. Locked door. Oh, 
suit. Not a locked door. Though definitely some enemies here. Oh, wrong one. You're an enemy. I think Bow Boy's an enemy. You're an enemy. Are you my neighbor? Everything's made of metal. Platinum. It's an interesting concept for a dungeon, because you're like... <sighs> I don't know about you guys, but when I think platinum, I'm thinking like something good. So the fact that platinum is like the... antagonist dungeon? is just an interesting concept to me. Belongs to Dark World, it sources the is source of the dark space. Entropy power is undeni is deniably the source of all light. Doubt this is going to work, but I'm going to try it anyways. Yep, didn't think so. I think I'm going to have to come back here. I'm gonna have to go back there once I get the get a assuming some sort of magical item that I need to equip. You're an enemy. You're an enemy. You're an enemy. There's no point to fighting the, guy, the enemies right now, because I don't need the money. That's all it does is just waste time. The Sun of Life will sink into the Western Sea forever. The immobile star of the gods will stand silently in the northern sky. Eventually, the Son of Oblivion will arrive from the eastern mountains. The world will be in flames and the southern land will turn to ash. So I believe what it wants me to do is... There we go. I think I gave my... D&D party a very, very similar, um... Prompt. For one of the puzzles they had. <laughs> Alright, well that was just a helmet. Um... Mm 
I'll have to see what happens when I go through this. I'm just gonna run through it, because who cares, I'll get healed by the time I get to the end. See if I can get through this dark area. There we go, and going which way? There we go, yep, no, yep, no, yep, maybe, maybe. Oh, there's, this is the right, rightmost room, I believe? That's what it looks like. Yeah, it's the rightmost. Looks like the leftmost is the way forward, or the middle is the way forward, but the leftmost... Oh, hey, another reviving mirror. Like, I didn't have four already, and I already sold two. Uh, I hate dark rooms like this, where it's just essentially just muddle your way through and like find a map in your head. goes the way out. Alright, there's a middle path. Left. Down. Goes all the way back down. No, that's not what I want. Up. Right. Down. Right. No, no, no. Yep, maybe. No. Yep, maybe. Up. That's effective. I don't want to go that way quite yet. There we go. Okay. Oh! 
Of course it's locked. Did all that just for that. Wait a second. Oh, there's no return button. Dang it. Never mind. I guess there's only certain rooms where there's a return button. Interesting. Hey Ferris, how's it going? That black floor is kind of creepy. Nothing in there besides the darkness. You can't feel anything. Entropy will destroy all of dark power. this room like again oh geez I gotta get all the way over there okay there's a plaque on the wall too okay Let's see if I can get There's a plaque. How do I get to plaque? Hey, plaque. What do you say? Powerless human. Where you're surrounded by my dark zone, there's only despair. Yeah, that's why I have a, a mace. Or a flail, actually. Morning star? This is technically what they call them. Alright, let's try this again. Okay, close. Down, left, down, left, down, left, down, left, down, left. Up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh. We'll get there eventually. Too far. Up. Left. Down, up. Down, left. Down, left. Down, left. Down, left. Yeah. <laughs> 
Okay. Wall down. Right. I'm in a room, aren't I? Okay, this room has nothing of value. Okay. This is riveting gameplay, just in a dark room trying to figure out where the heck I am. Copy this. I'm just gonna move this to the first slot at this point. Because I keep on using this a lot, so. I'm against the wall, alright. Let me get some in the corner. Okay, where am I now? There we go. Just had to follow the wall. Key! Oh, I love rooms like this. Thankfully, it's fairly easy to find my way out. Hopefully. Check this again. Okay, go up and to the right. All right.
down, left, down, right. there we go, there we go, exit, stupid room, alright, go down there, now we're here, go over here, I'm really gra glad I grabbed this bounce spell way back when this thing just cast it it'll bounce around and tell me where I need to go Come on. Let's see here. Where are we going? Okay, I'm all the way in the corner. That's probably not the best. Let's see here. There we go. Almost. There we go. Alright, there we go. <sighs> Alright, my inventory's getting full again. So this place is called the Platinum Shrine. It's a neat name. Castle Key. Darn mess. Take the damage, keep running. Cause it's just not worth fighting him. Alright, go up the stairs. Back to this zone. Alright, let's try here. Absolutely nothing over there. I don't know why there's that it's random panels like that. I could jump across there if I wanted to. Ah, nope, not doing that. Let's try the key here. Thought to be used to get to the second floor. Not there. Swing around. I'm just gonna pop down here for a second. Pop back up. That way, when I inevitably fall off... Alright. Ooh, second floor access. Nope, can't go that way. Uh, 
to the music. Of course I did. Up. Oh great, they're gravity balls. They pull you in. Just keep running, just keep running, just keep running, running, running. What do you do? You run, 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 run. Okay. Chest. Endless key. All right. Anything else here? Nope. All right, I'm just going to fall. Damage warp. and falling apart. Are there any other doors? I don't know where else this can be used. a door there. How do I get there? Oh, wait, there's one further down, duh. This game is just a lot of keys. Use one key to get to another key, to get to the other key, to get to the other key. Are you kidding me? me. Alright. Darn gravity balls. Diagonal jumps. <laughs> Unintentional. Me getting sloppy. up. Spirit key. Let me guess, it goes to the other door around here.
All right, almost through here. Let's see. The spirit of goblins is strong here. So, demons? I guess they just want to use our demons for whatever reason for this game. Oh. I feel like spikes are going to pop up from somewhere. And you, sir, are alive. Both of you two are alive. going to hit one of you. You're alive, maybe. That works. You're alive. You're alive. You're alive. Hmm, neither of you are alive, thankfully. Oh. Meeting dragon was your fate. The time was already growing short. You know that already. Okay. I want to say welcome. It looks like someone popped in for a second. Alright, so what I'm looking at for these guys, see how those... These two dudes are straight gray, but these two have a slight purple tint to them, so I think these two are alive and are going to attack me. Yep. Then you see how these bows are different on these two guys below that look like moles? The one on the left is alive, the one on the right is not. See here. Locked, not locked. Where am I going in this room? Let's see. Oh dear lord. Okay. Uh left up. Left and up. Okay, that's easy enough. Alright. Sorry, looking at the other part of the map, too. Oh, but you gotta use... Oh, shoot. Okay. see what path I can track. Let's see here again. I can go... Okay, I can take the right, go all the way across, up. Oh, it's easy enough. Okay. So what I'm doing is I'm going to go up here, Remember which buttons jump, which I did not. Uh, use the wrong path, because that's the wrong path. We're going to go just straight right. Run like my life depends on it, and please don't suck me in. And 
this way and down because I made a wrong turn. Go this way. Do this this way. And then this way. Alright, let's double check this, make sure I know what I'm doing. Go down and to the left. Down to the left, go all the way up and around. That should work, right? Yeah, I think. That's all right. Then hope I can make a diagonal jump. There we go. Key. Night key. All right, go down. Keep going down. Jump. Left. Or that's all right. I know my directions. All right, gonna go here. Let's see if it works. Even time seems to be controlled by the dark. Nope, not that one. All right. Go to the right, see if it works on any of these. None of these guys are alive. That's an open door, that's a locked door. I'll try the locked door first. Part of me is hoping for a magic sword that does like 20 damage versus this flail that does 15 because it's just nice that way. Nothing there. Okay, goes down here. I was defeated, but with this one, this battle's over. Hmm. So he was defeated, but he's alive? Maybe? I don't like the fact that that staircase goes up, so that's why I'm going this way. Go through this door here just to see what's in here. Okay, green panels. Switch warp me. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. Alright. Warp puzzles. Let's see where I go. Okay. That one was simple enough. was for an item, which is okay with me. Alright, uh... 15, nice. Set with jewels, has great power. Alright, now where's my magic sword? this one and we're out okay now then back through here just dodge you dodge you 
dodge you, slowing the game down because I'm not killing any of you. <laughs> I should have just killed them as I went, because they were slowing down the game a lot. That's alright. I already talked with you, Ryan. You're not a bad guy. Sort of lame. He's my least favorite character in this game. Probably Ferris or Cashin are my favorite, besides the main character. Uh, Barnus, he's a pretty cool guy. Dark water will melt everything and brings destruction to everyone. I noticed that. Uh, well, I guess I never realized it was water, I just always thought it was void, but that's alright. Rainer, Barnus has been injured. No, not Barnus, I like you! You better not frickin' die. Okay. Good. Don't you dare die on me. Phaser! Ooh, it's like the, uh... Ice spell. that I used to freeze the lava, except it does it in poison water? Okay. Alright, yeah, I'm gonna go this way because there's like two little... There's a, um... Looks like a little island over here, which may have a chest on it, and I bet to the far left is probably a key. Which I'll need, because that's just how this game is. It's key finder simulator, it feels like sometimes. Why is everything a simulator? It's a game. And these guys lock up their places really well. Magic Sword? Source of power. What is my stats actually? 42 power. Alright. Um, before I use that, I will probably wait till I get to a save point. Because I like using them when I have a save point. Yeah, save point. Because you can manipulate the RNG a little bit for those guys. So what they do is they give you a power boost. Uh, one to three. And you can actually manipulate how big of a boost that is. It just takes... You just have to essentially reset your game sometimes. Seems like when you're in a dungeon in particular, it usually boosts to three if you restart your game right after, or right before you try and use it.
Jeez! Alright, let's see what we got here. Okay, down from here. Moving up, up. Okay, door there. Let's see here. Got this, these x ray glasses again. Let's see what we got. We got Phantom Room. Wow, okay. I think I want to go. This door in front of me, far left, middle, and then middle. We'll see where it goes from there. I feel like I'm getting close to the end of this dungeon, though. Platinum key. Oh, and yeah, I'll just fall off. One health, which heals by no. Ooh, meat. I'll just. Eat this, I suppose. And I'm curious, is this the platinum key? Probably not contaminated by the dark power. Okay, so it's not there, so I guess I do have to go into the second door. See what's through here. It's a small room. Remember to hit your chest just in case there are mimics. Great axe. What is that? 20 power? A long string of teeth. It's so short! Uh, I don't like that. Heavy maul. It's more powerful, I know, but it's just. The range is too short for me, because I don't like getting that close, especially when you get the enemies you get here. Door to the afterworld, dark territory, even time dies here. Let's see here, what's the dungeon look like? Doubt there's anything over there, but I'll check just to be safe. Yep. Why do I feel like I'm missing, like, five health? My health bar doesn't go as far as I think it should, but... It's okay. Where else could there be a key? Let's think here. Alright. So I went that way. It's gotta be that one room, because that's the only thing that makes sense.
try it again, see what happens. Key won't go in. Alright, let's backtrack and see if there's another keyhole somewhere. Can't recall one offhand. Let's walk right off the edge. Let's try it. Forty three. Reset game real quick. See if it works. If not, oh well, I'll just take what I get. Maybe at least at 42. Or, yeah. Or 44, something like that. Eight hours in. Not a bad run time. What am I doing? Forty-four, good enough. Got a plus two versus a plus one. That's where Ryan was sitting. Rain. Maybe the far left room? I can't imagine anywhere else. Yes, there was a room over here that I couldn't unlock because... Yeah, okay. That makes sense. So the key worked on the other one, then I got the armor in the other room. Or something like that. And there are panels that are falling off this floor. Platinum sword! Great, is it 20? 10? It's probably quick. It is quicker though, so. But what does that help with?
I'm not sure why it, what that helps me with. I mean, are there areas on these other floors that... There's that central room there. Yeah, that would help me there. Okay. It's that super long trek, though. Just run. Don't get hit too often. Hey, a reviving mirror. Not like I have 15 of them already. That was my fault. First off, where am I in this room? And where am I trying to get to? Okay, there's two different ways up. Okay. That's the way I came from. So, can't do that way. I go up at all, to the right, up right, up right, up right, up right. Okay, so it splits like that, goes here, goes down. Okay, let's see where you lead. Chest! Destruction key! It's probably the key I need. Alright, where's the other place lead? Not gonna lie, I was hoping the magic sword I get from here would have been a little bit more powerful than 10 power, but it is the most powerful sword in the game. Axe is technically the most powerful weapon I have, but it's just... its range is... Nothing. Okay, too far, so let's take like a two second walk up. One, two, two. And see where I'm at now. Super close. Alright, let's.
There we go. It's locked. Okay, please be for this room. Thank the Lord. Fountain key. All right. Well, there's no other place I can go except for back up to the very beginning at Platinum. I'm not sure where Platinum 2 is. I feel like I skipped that last time, too. But it's alright. Probably don't need it. Hopefully. I probably should save. Now I'm thinking about it. Let's save this real quick. Not like I don't have 15 mirrors and all that, but... Better safe than sorry. you hop in here? Uh, gonna do this real quick. <laughs> Not bad. You just get in here? Nice. Also, I added you as a moderator. to go to the next door. Oh yeah, sorry. I thought I thought I mentioned it. That's all right. My fault. Please be the right key. Gosh dang it. No, I'm gonna go back to town for a second. I need, I got some stuff I need to sell, like 15 herbs and some other stuff. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. So I have a ton of money. I don't think I've ever had this much money in this game. Mm. Yeah, I'm not gonna need it. So you. So you, so you, not gonna bother with the bow, don't need you, uh, yeah I only died like once. reorganize. Oh, I need to buy a couple warp gates. 
That's all right. Nope. I need to move that anyways. Yeah, I wasn't kidding. I have a ton of money. Can't sell the fire sword because it's like a special item. Uh, copy that. And I'll move the platinum sword. Oh, thank you! I was hoping it'd be a good mix. And also, as you can tell, I'm, I moved my mic a little bit, so it's on like a little boom. So hopefully I get a little bit better audio quality with it not being far from me. So I'm, I'm slowly trying to make some improvements. One, two... Yeah, I'll buy four, because I'm going to use one. I can't even remember where I got this mic from. I think I got it from Micro Center for like 20 bucks. It's actually not a bad mic. Then this arm I'm using actually, I it used to be for a uh, tablet stand for like hanging off your bed, but I uh, took it took it apart, took this little mount off, and took apart the mount that I had for the microphone and put it on here instead. Uh, let's see here, do I have it here? Nah, I don't. Okay. Alright, let's see here, I got all that there. That looks good, that looks good. I'm gonna view, because might as well. Yeah, I, uh... Yeah, <laughs> if it works, it works. So I might or might not have sold like all my uh, fairy jade except for the ones I use because there's no point to keeping them and they just slow you down if you have too many items anyways so might as well just do that. Oh, shoot. I'm gonna go to platinum one and see what I can find. Did all that area there. <sighs> yeah, yeah, I <laughs> I used to call it Slasher, yeah. I think I just kept it the name it was, I think it was Wack, W A K. Same with the initial one, I used to call it, like, Blaze or something like that, and I just called it, I think it was just called, um, Ifree or something like that, which is Ifree, but, yeah, I just sold all of it, because I'm like, this is not worth it. I have no idea. This key doesn't work. I'm gonna have to backtrack and just keep going. Yeah, it's funny, the attack jade is actually called Sarah. Oh, I do like the baseline for this song. Definitely something you can rock out to.
Mm, let's see here, where am I? There. Yeah, no, nothing was there. Nothing was there. So nothing on this area at all. Yeah, I, I will say there are issues with this game. It's not perfect by any means, but it is definitely one of the better action RPGs for the Super Nintendo. Granted, there are like a million of them, so there's a lot of competition there, but yeah, some of them are just really good. I mean, you got Illusion of Gaia, which is another one I think I might play on here at some point. Which is just another one, but that one's... I've never beaten the secret dungeon on there. Like, when you collect all the red gems. Like, that final boss of that red dungeon is just... Oh yeah, definitely the slowdown is the big one. Uh, but yeah, the, uh... The slow or the slowdowns are honestly the biggest issue, because it's like if you have anything other than like two things on screen, it just slows down like nobody's business. But I think that's honestly that's more not a flaw of this game, because it's really just pushing itself. But because I mean, the Super Nintendo in general had that issue if you had anything from like I think Legend of Zelda Link to the Past did it um, uh, not Majora, Majora's Mask uh, Metroid uh, Metroid Super Metroid had a lot of issues similar to this where it just it was just slow it's not the fault of the not the fault of the game in a way it's just if you had more than three sprites on screen, it just died. Yeah. Especially with the soundtracks, too. And this audio design. I mean, you, they went from 8-bit to 16-bit, so they got at least... I forget how many more combinations, then. Well, it'd be... yeah. A lot more combinations. But yeah, so just the bit crushed audio and all that is just. It's good for what it's worth. Dancing Mad. All that. And I agree, definitely my favorite system of all time. <laughs> I don't know. I. There are a couple handhelds that I would say are probably up there with some of the best, though. Yeah, N64, a very close second. I feel like there's at least one or two handhelds, though, that could probably put up a good fight versus some of this stuff. Oh, wait, it's that door, duh. Uh... Game Boy Advance, I mean, that thing killed it for what it's worth. Um, PSP, I mean, I never really owned one, but they were like the ultimate emulation devices, plus you got just so many good games that they pushed it so hard on that system. I mean, you could almost consider it probably like Nintendo Switch graphics since Nintendo's so behind on that like 10 years ago yeah it's just yeah the GBA had a pretty good lifespan especially when you include the SP I mean the DS the DS and the 3DS, they were quite literally, I mean, other than the Wii, that was like probably one of the most popular systems ever. Because of the way they handled, 
I mean, they were built as like the family console. Especially the Wii. You had, I think that they said that's like the most, the highest selling device. Save like the, um, uh, what would it be? Save for maybe the Nintendo? Maybe? I'm not sure. I feel like that's something like that. Cause it just sold millions upon millions of copies of that of that system. But yeah, definitely PSP was revolutionary for its time. Sorry, my conversations are just scattered for whatever reason right now. It's alright, we'll figure it out. Ah, shoot. Of course I did. Alright, Brennan, survive. Bats! I haven't seen you since Dungeon 2. I can just kill them because they're always going to shock me anyways. Power of defense? Oh, a heart! I haven't had one of those in a while. A full heal plus a one. An apple? Don't need that. Come on! Try us again. No detours this time. Alright. Go up this way. Go this way. Slow downs because who doesn't need those? Ice does more damage than Phaser, apparently. Even though Phaser is the ultimate in scientific magic. According to Barnus. Who cough hack almost died. Shoot! Go, 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 go! Almost just lost it. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> Dark rooms, of course. Where am I? Okay, there's two points of interest, one in the bottom left-hand corner, and then you got the staircase up. Let's try to get to the... Uh, I hate these. These dark rooms are bad, too, though. Thankfully, I got the bouncy balls. They help a little bit.
Okay, so that's this place here. Let's see where this goes. Chest. Remember to always hit your chest. You never know when they're going to be a mimic. Oh no. Not you guys. Okay, where am I? Oh, I'm all the way over here. Alright. Let's see if I keep going up. There we go. Am I against the big wall? Let's see. Yes, I am. Alright. Uh, let's throw some bouncy balls. No. Why do I feel like I'm on a conveyor belt? I'm on a conveyor belt. Am I? Can't stink and tell. I'm in a corner. No, don't eat food. Okay. Oh, jeez. That would suck. How's that going for you? You're working out and all that. I'm glad that you're doing it, too. I think my goal is honestly just to be able to work out maybe three times a week or so. My goal at the moment. Though I've been really slacking on that. So far I've done two times this week.
How far am I going? Did I hit the other wall? Oh, nice. Okay. I'm at least halfway there. That's fair, yeah. When money's on the line, it makes it a little bit more worth it, right? Yeah, well, I'm, I'm glad that you're getting in shape and taking care of yourself. It's, it's great. I'm happy for you, bud. Okay, got a staircase up, got some stuff to the left. Um, well, first off, let's see if there's even a door down here. There is. Let's go up the stairs, see what's up here, I guess. Doing this program, he's got me up set for six months. Nice. That's good. Ooh, even better, yeah. Yeah, that's that's great. I mean do you do like a lot of like weight workouts or anything like that, or is it mostly just um uh what's the word? Um, or a dumb, oh, okay, just with dumbbells, good. Yeah, I, I don't know why, I think it's just because I never really was, I never really did it in school, but I'm just not a fan of the, like, dumbbell regiments, or even depth, especially not the deadlift sort of stuff, I just don't like doing that sort of stuff. I don't know why. I just never did. Oh, shoot, that hurt. Okay, that's good. Yeah, I think the sort of trainings I I usually like are the ones that are more um uh what's the word? Uh bodyweight exercises. Stuff like that. Yeah, exactly, yeah. You don't need to be jacked, just have more energy to do things. That's all that matters. Like I said, I'm happy for you, though. Let's 
stupid puzzles. Half body weight, half dumbbell. Good. Good mix. Ow, ow, ow. Lag. Bouncy ball. Yeah, that, that's that's fair. I mean, you just gotta stick with it and keep up with it. Eat healthy. I mean, honestly, eating healthy is probably even more important than even just working out. In a lot of times, because uh, oftentimes it's the working at or it's the actual. Um, Uh, what's it called? The actual process of even doing that is better for you because you honestly lose more calories based off of what you eat versus, um, yes, portion control. Yeah, because you lose more weight by doing that than anything you do with working out, because all that does is really build muscle. Plenty of warp gates, I'm gonna use one. Gosh dang it. Right, let's try this again. I don't know if I'll be able to beat this game tonight. It's so close. For two hours 45 minutes, and it's almost midnight here. So, I got work in the morning. And yeah, we'll get there. Almost there. Alright, any more sticking keys? Thank you. Get to the afterworld. Everything is dark and gloomy. Demon King must be around here somewhere. Alright, this might be it. Gonna use... Nah, I'll leave that for now. I'll use you though. Alright, let's see what happens. Is it worth putting on the defense? No, I think this might be better. Alright, final boss. Here we go. How are this human? What can you do? sink into the whirlpool of darkness. 
Xehanort? Semnus? Weird demon thing? Oops. Ooh, three damage. Okay, that's not too bad. Lag? My worst enemy? I don't remember how to hit him. Where is your weak point? Alright. Oh. Yep, sorry about that. I'll be done soon, I think. I just need to figure out how to hurt this dude. Use this. Forgot I have these guys too. Let's just pop a drink. And we'll pop a power capsule. Oh, I can only pop one at a time. Okay. Well, maybe. I... Stop do anything. Nope. I don't think so. I guess it slows him down, or is that just a lag? Combination of both. How the heck do I hurt this guy? I cannot remember. Well, first off, let's try... ...you. There we go. Just needed a longer weapon. Than me. Oh! That's it. Oh, wait, he has another form. I remember this now. <laughs> like, there's no way that's, that's it. Charges you. Gotta hit him in the face. Bomb. Cracks the floor. Watch where you step. Um, yeah, I'll be fine. Now his arm's a spider, which I just killed. Or did a lot of damage to it, at least. Uh, I just stepped over that platform I didn't mean to. Got a whatever the heck that is, a bat. Alright, use another one of these guys. Use a power booster. Oh, you're dead. You're dead. Are you dead yet? 
Yep. Anything left? Yes, okay. What is there? Actually. Oh, just hit him. Okay, I can do that. Oh, dear lord, please, please, oh please, I did not fall in that pit. Thank god. Alright, let's get out of here. Warp gate, anybody? This dragon has fallen. Its spirit finally freed from having held down the power of the Demon King for so long. Run! Game Planner, Shinji Yamada. Well. Only took me about 11 hours. That's not bad. Over three streams, I think. Granted, part of that was just mindless grinding that I could have did other times and stuff like that, or not really necessary grinding. Wow. Dragon! That's... It wasn't me that did it. That's quite literally scripted in the game. They just fall in a hole and fall off the cliff. And now they're laying in the grass, presumably outside the shrine? Or they're dead. Link is dead. Yeah, so like, the, when you killed the Demon King, he just, or... Dark King? I forget what they call him. When you kill him, he just sort of falls into the... Or the entire platinum shrine that he was housed in just falls apart. Product coordinator Robert L. Gerald. Enix America staff. Paul Bowler. Paul Handelman. Jake Cazadel. Cadeo. Castle. Not gonna lie, Ninja, I don't remember this dungeon at all. And last time I beat this game was like four years ago. Five years ago. Yeah, I'm melancholy, but I think he survives in all honesty. Produce Co. Limited. <laughs> Opus Corp. 
Tja. Enix. So if I remember right, I think... Wait, based upon Brain Lord. Of course it's based upon Brain Lord. Is Brain Lord also a... Um... Something else? Is there maybe like a book or something like that? What? What? Notorious bandit Num Numakuna has been seen in town? Lord of 5,000 gold? <laughs> That's chump change. See? You survive. Welcome. You have a new job. I just saved the world and killed a demon king. You think a bandit lord is going to be anything? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking, too. Did you find a good job? We want to go with you. Don't go on ahead alone. Ryan, weren't you going to open a restaurant? What the heck are you doing here? Yeah, that's what I was thinking, too. Let me guess, she's expecting... Knew it! <laughs> that doesn't sound right. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out, like... Okay, Barnus, he makes sense. He's... He's like a a priest sort of thing, and he's trying to like discover the different archaeological things because it like his ancestors were part of all this. Ryan, he needs money. Ferris, her entire thing was why are like she's trying to find someone to essentially meet the dragon and become the dragon warrior. What the heck is Cassian's deal? I haven't figured that out yet. Like, it's just... She's just there. She doesn't really add anything to the... actual narrative? That's one thing that I've noticed about this it's like you got all these you got a lot of characters where it's like you got their name but that's about all you have about them all right well looks like that's pretty much it so i guess i'm going to stop the recording at least And play a little bit of this in the background. For a little bit, but I don't really like that actually. Eh. Alright. Well, I guess that's all I'm going to do for tonight. So thank you all so much for joining me. Uh, thank you, Ninja, for being a wonderful person in chat. And I will see you all next time.